Thank you for joining us. Welcome to Lumio Station. What's good, YouTube? Happy Boy 92 here, back again once again. Today, people, today we are finally back for episode number three, I do believe, of our Pokemon Ash Gray Let's Play exclusively right here on Lumio Station. I never remember what episode this is. Doesn't matter what Let's Play I'm doing. If I do Coliseum, I'm sitting there like, ah, this is episode number eight. Yeah, sure, that's what it is, you know. I never remember what episode it is, but I'm pretty sure this is episode number three. I do apologize for not having this up last week for you guys. Some shit came up with the end of my first class, and now I'm in a new class. It started in the beginning of class is always easy as fuck, so it's like, <laughs> fuck y'all shit, nigga. So yeah, so we're here, we're gonna do this, um, and the last episode, you guys did smash a thousand likes, which is fucking amazing. Like, it's one thing for, like, you guys to come out and show support on my channel, but for you guys to come over here to Lumio Station and really, like, show the support for the series, that's fucking amazing. That's really, really humbling. Like, thank you guys, no matter where we go, no matter what we do, you guys are there with the support. It's, it's just... Thank you, thank you for that. So in return, we're gonna have a nice longer episode today, and of course that, that still stands. If we can smash a thousand likes on the episode, then we'll keep the long episodes coming, um, and all that good levity bullshit. Now, you guys also brought up something because I was just gonna play through Ash Gray, and whatever events we ran into, we ran into. I wasn't gonna sit there and really like be super meticulous about it. Um, I guess because the first time I played through it, like, eight, nine months ago, that's kind of sort of what we did, and we still ran into a shit ton of events. You know, <laughs> there wasn't a whole lot of events that we didn't really cover, um, but I guess, I guess what I'm asking is, what, what do you guys think we should do? Should we just play through the game and whatever we encounter, we encounter, or should we, like, try and get every single event that happens in the game? If that's the case, then I'm gonna go back, like, probably off-screen between this episode and the next one, and, like, catch a Caterpie and catch a Pidgeotto and all that shit, because we didn't do that. Because as of right now, are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? The colossal monumental party that, that we have. Motherfucking Negachu himself, Growl Thundershock, Quick Attack, and Thunder Wave. And he is, and I quote, and he is rocking that light ball. So, I mean, it really, it's it's up to you guys. Like I said, I was just going to treat it like a regular Let's Play and just go through and just pick up whatever. Do whatever we encountered. But uh, if you guys want us to get all the events done, then I will. I'll take the time out to go catch a Caterpie and to go and get a uh, Pidgeotto and whatnot. Actually, you know what? Let me see. Let me see here real quick. Let me see here. We got nine Pokeballs. Let's go see if we can't catch a Caterpie. I should turn that fucking speed up button off. I should turn that speed up button off. That's what I really want to do. A lot of people have been getting into that as of late. I know uh, in the Fire Red Leaf Green co-op that, uh, or versus I should say, that me and Calum are doing, we're not having the speed up. And some people are like, that's terrible. It's That's garbage. Don't, don't do that. Because, you know, that makes the game last so much longer. But it's like, at the same time, I, I don't want to say like it's more enjoyable. I just feel like I'm getting more out of the game. If that makes sense. I'm getting like more out of the game when I do that. And it feels more like a genuine playthrough. I guess that's the best. I guess that's, you know what, now that I think about it, that's really what comes from it. Wait, 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 I can do this with a Metapod too, right? It doesn't have to be a Caterpie, because all you need, all you need the Caterpie for is the Butterfree event, right? On the SSN. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to go ahead, I'm going to Thunder Wave this shit, just to be pro, just to be pro, give it a status ailment. Um, I think that's what I'm going to do, I'm going to catch this Metapod, and if you guys know if it has to be a Caterpie, let me know. I think it just needs to be a Butterfree. We just need to have a Butterfree for that event. Really? Really? We're trying to be pro here, Metapod! Pro Metapod, please stop. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Give a nickname to the Metapod? Yes. Yes. He's gonna be Pro Metapod. <laughs> I'm so done. He's gonna be Pro Me Oh shit, it's not gonna fit. Will it fit? Met- uh, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Wait, wait, wait. If I do Pro Metapod, I feel like this still isn't gonna fit. Oh my god, it's gonna fit! Oh my god, it's gonna fit! Oh my god, it's gonna fit! Pro Metapod himself. Pro Metapod, all caps, because he's pro. But yeah, I feel like you just get more of a genuine experience out of the game if you actually just like slow down, because it's like you're actually playing the game like on your uh, DS or your Game Boy Advance or, or um, what was the other, what the other one? Game Boy SP? It came away SP, what the fuck? Oh my god, it's so old! It is so old school, Game Boy SP. Oh god, I think I had like a lime green one. 
I think I had a lime green Game Boy SP when I was a kid growing up. I feel like that's what I had. I feel like I had a silver one too. I don't remember. I don't know. But anyways, in the last episode, you guys, we went up here to Brock's gym. We did a little event there. We got our light bulb Pikachu and we smashed and got our first gym badge. And now I'm about to pick up some Pokeballs. Can I get six? Please and thank you. Do we have any potions in the bag? No potions in the bag. God damn, give me that. We don't have any status ailment shit either. But today's episode, hopefully, we're going to make our way to Mount Moon and through Mount Moon. And of course, I'm sure we're going to run into Team Rocket there as well. Being Team Rocket, doing Team Rocket things, being just, just, uh, <laughs> Team Rocket. Um, so what I think I'm going to do, you know what, fuck, god damn it, I got to get Pro Metapod out front here. Cause I, I gotta get Pro Metapod to evolve. Cause Nikachu, Nikachu has all the power. Nikachu has. Look at Pro Metapod. Oh, Pro Metapod. He's got tackle. Let's do it. Let's. Oh God, no, no, that's doing too much damage. Never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say, let's do it. Let's just go. Let's just go hard. The motherfucking paint. God damn. Fuck, fuck everybody up with Pro Metapod. But we won't. We won't. We won't. We won't. We won't. But yeah, we need to get Pro Metapod to evolve into Butterfree so they can at least defend itself somewhat. 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 We can get some sleep powders and poison powders and shit. <laughs> That'll be about it. Look at that. Level 6. Domination has begun. Domination. No, not domination. Domination has begun. Okay, so just because I'm OCD, I'm OCD as shit. I don't know about you guys. And look at this. I just did that whole big speech about uh, not speeding up. And I'm just sliding around town going through that shit. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave the speed up off on new routes. Like right now we'll just leave this off and then I'll use it in like stupid ass battles like this. Cause this is just like this is just some bullshit right here. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This is some bullshit. You just expect me to sit here and fight this Pidgey time and time again. Can you please stop with the gust? Hold the thunder shot. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. But as I said, domination has begun. Pro Metapod is on its way to freedom. It's actually a she, goddamn. Pro Metapod is on her way to freedom. That's like foresight future warning I think I found a walkthrough for Ash Gray 2 just in case like you guys want to see like I say like too much just in case we we're gonna do like every single event because I feel like I need that because I'm not like super duper into the anime uh, like I watched it a lot when I was a kid but I mean I don't remember every single episode and now like as an adult I try to go back and watch it and it just angers me it just pisses me off <gasps> we got hardened oh my god the domination is here it's real it just angers me because it's like Ash is such a dumbass literally he's such a dumbass poison sting how do you like this hardened bitch 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 tackle oh god it's not gonna do enough it's not gonna do enough it's not gonna do enough damn it wasted too many turns I can't be switched out because the rap. Come on. Come on. Pro Metapod. Pro Metapod. There we go. <laughs> he will be great one day. He will be great one day. You'll just have to wait and see. He will be great one day. Um, but yeah, like I try and watch it now, and it's just completely aggravating. I cannot watch Ash. I cannot listen to him. I can't no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like you I, I feel like you have to be a kid to thoroughly enjoy that. Especially like the older episodes where Ash just blatantly makes dumb ass decisions and terrible mistakes. And um, some of you guys know Vegas Jamie, some of you guys might not know her. Um, but she mentioned something to me and she said Ash never actually catches any Pokemon. Like it's not it's not like a blanket term. Of course I'm sure he catches some Pokemon here and there throughout the anime, but for the most part, like, he never catches any Pokemon. Like, all Pokemon are either given to him or they decide to join him on his journey. And it's like, how are you going to be the greatest trainer and catch them all if you don't even catch a single one? Like, uh, off the top of my head, Season 1, because if you guys don't know, Season 1, the Indio League of Pokemon, and, uh, I think it's the Best Wishes? I don't know what the beginning of Black and White is, but the first season of Pokemon, then Black and White, and then the Victini and Zekrom, Victini, Zekrom, Victini, and Reshiram movies are now on Netflix. And, um, oh my god, we're gonna die. Nikachu's gonna pass out. <sighs> Nikachu, no! Oh god, what is this nonsense? Pro Metapod, as a dead nigga, he went for tail wave. Oh! <laughs> Pro Metapod, it's up to you, man. It's up to you, man. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Alright, but anyways, they are on Netflix right now. And, um, I was watching it, and if you guys wanna know what the best episode is in the Indigo League, it's season one, which is Indigo League, episode 22. <sighs> 
go check it out. I won't tell it. I won't. I won't spoil it and say what it is. But season one, episode twenty-two, is the best one. True. Very true. Very true. Very true. Very true. Very true. But all right, Pro Minipod, we're not gonna lose this time. That poison was a bitch. We probably couldn't gotten through here all the way to the other side. I wonder if they have a Pokemon Center out here, like in the regular game. I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. You know, I don't really care for the Pokemon design in Ash Gray. That's just me. That's just me. I'd rather have a regular one. It's just, it's such an awkward just design. Like to look at. It's just like, what is this building? It looks like a tire. I'm trying to go to the Pokemon Center and this building looks like a tire. What the fuck? But alright, let's get the hell out of here. Probably in the next episode, I'll actually disable the. Are you kidding me? You were off the screen, you ass! He was off the screen! Your Pokemon likes to suck blood, that means you have a fat bat. You have a fat bat on your team. Yes, he does. Ew, fat bat, fat bat, fat bat, fat bat. What level does Metapod evolve? Is it the level 12, 13? He evolves into Breath of Free. Some shit like that? I don't remember. I don't remember, I don't remember, I don't remember. Are you a trainer? God damn, you are a trainer. My Puff Puff, Jigglypuff. Um, but, uh. I was saying something, I don't, I don't remember. A tire Pokemon Center or some shit like that? I don't know. This Jigglypuff just threw me off because more random ass facts for you guys. Apparently, it was it was one of these accounts on Twitter that tweeted it out, like the did you know shit. Apparently the Jigglypuff that was in the anime is shiny. <laughs> All this time, growing up watching it, I never knew. Oh my god, it's level 10. Pro Metapod is evolving. Pro Metapod is evolving! Oh my god! <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'll take it. You beautiful monster! The JK, you're ugly as shit. God damn. You're ugly as shit. It's still gonna be called Pro Metapod though. Sleep powder on deck. Let's go. Everything's going to sleep and dying from here on out. Gonna lead, put it to sleep. Choice scarf butterfree. <laughs> oh wow, he healed my Pokemon! Wow 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 wow. Choice Scarf, Butterfree, oh god, so there is no Pokemon Center, that's why it's there. Yeah! A wild Zubat attack! <laughs> Help me! Okay. Don't mind if I do, man. Don't mind if I do, can I catch this Zubat? Can I catch you, man? Can I catch you? Sleep Powder! Go to sleep, bitch. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Pro Metapod in the building. Pro Meta- Oh, you walk- You ass! You ass, stay asleep. Stay asleep. Zubat's over here rocking early bird. The fuck out. Stay asleep. There you go. I'm gonna catch him. I'm gonna catch him. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. We caught him. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for allowing me to capture you, Mr. Zubat. I'm gonna call him Fat Bat. Just because it's gonna be all lowercase because I feel like that's funnier when you look at it. Fat Bat. Fat Bat. Just look at it, it's Fat Bat. Oh my god. Thank you so much, you saved my life. My name is Seymour the Scientist. Somebody has strung up lights in the Mount Moon, causing the nocturnal Pokemon to fly out. They're after the Moonstone, I'm sure of it. The Moonstone was brought here from another planet by Clefairy. That's right, Clefairy are aliens. Please go help them. No, how about you fuck off? How's that? There's nothing over here? I feel like there should be something there, but there's nothing there. Oh well. Anything here? Alright, anyways, Mount Moon it is! Mount Moon it is. I feel like having a Nuzlocke of this game would just be awkward. I feel like Nuzlocking Ash Gray is just awkward. I feel like it's not meant to be that way. I don't know why, it just that just feels awkward. But now that Pro Metapod has evolved that can actually hold his own, we don't have to keep switch training into Nikachu. So we have Fat Bat, Pro Metapod, and Nikachu in the party right now. Oh god, good times, good times, good times. And this is not six gen bitch, so go to sleep! Yeah, motherfucker, yeah, 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 yeah. God damn it, they just wake right up! What is the point? What is the point? Stay asleep. Stay asleep, but we're not about to do that. Oh, Fat Bat's asleep. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell, Fat Bat? We need to go back down there and heal. Because I'm not trying to have... Fat Bat, what are you doing? What are you doing, Fat Bat? Wake the hell up. Wake the hell up. Akon E40, wake it up, my lord! Come on, man, get this shit out of here. And if I do remember correctly from 
this when we live stream like there's two different routes to this cave and one of them is like the correct route and the other one just like leads you to like items or some shit I don't remember exactly I don't remember exactly but I need you down here sir get my Pokemon thank you thank you come again thank you come again all right so let's get the fuck up out this bitch and god I wish I had repels repels for the Zubats would be so nice Oh my god, I was gonna say, we got all the way through that tunnel without having any fucking repels, that was amazing! A potion, not bad. Not bad, not bad at all. Are you going the right way? You're gonna- Oh my god, stop! I think I took a wrong turn somewhere, you know what, off here, kid? Hopefully that's like a good sign that we're going towards the items and we just have to backtrack. Geo, dude! Uh, let's put you to sleep, oh dude! Ah, 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 ah! Too far- Wow, they keep waking up! This is such ass, such ass, such ass. Fuck out of here. Pro Metapod with the stun spore, with the stun spore. I think since Pro Metapod is level 11 now, it can hold its own. We're gonna start switch training Fat Bat here. Fat Bat, out to Negachu. Fat Bat to Negachu. Fat Bat to Negachu. Thundershock, Thundershock, Thundershock. Of course, the light ball allowing us to do whatever we want to whoever we want, to whomever we want. Onyx, uh, Fat Bat, I need you to pick up all this EXP. As long as this shit doesn't know Earthquake, we're good. Negachu can take a hit. Surprisingly enough, look at the paralysis. Surprisingly enough, Negachu can take a hit. Cause, oh wow, the defense dropped too? Cause Pikachu is so ass, so ass, so ass. And now that we're playing, god damn it. Now that we're playing Ash Gray, he's gonna have to stay at Pikachu. We can't evolve him into Raichu, which just sucks. That sucks. Oh my god, Pidgey! Sleep Powder. This will solve everything. This will solve everything. We don't have to go back to the forest. So even if you guys wanted me to do whatchamacallit, there we go, we caught him. Even if you guys wanted us to do, uh, whatchamacallit, the, all the events, we don't have to actually go all the way back to Viridian Forest. Alright, give a nickname to the Pidgey. Oh, God. I feel like everyone is going to kill me if I don't do this. So let's just go ahead and do it. Let's just go ahead and do it. Oh, God damn it. Just go ahead and do it. 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 Boom, there you go. Bird Jesus has joined the party. Alright, we got a nugget. That'll help. That'll help. That'll definitely help. I feel like that staircase is gonna be where we come out of. Anyways, fuck this shit. We don't have repels. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Push through. What is with these trainers? I can just see from. <laughs> They can see me from a mile away. Like, what type of horse shit is that? That's is, that is bullshit. Go to sleep and stay asleep. Do not wake up, you ass. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Tackle. Crit tackles. Sleep powder. I love it. I love this so much. He woke up, you ass. Stay asleep. Focus energy, my ass crack. Fuck off. Judo, no. Sleep powder. Go to sleep. I love this. I love this strategy. I love this strategy. Nigga, you come on out and do your thing. Do your thing, motherfucker. Do your thing. Light ball, thunder shot. Can we get a thunderbolt? Can we get a thunderbolt? Can we get a thunderbolt, ladies and gentlemen? We can get thunderbolt. Light ball, thunderbolt. We'll wreck everything in there. It just, just, uh, it's just gonna destroy everything. Bird Jesus is asleep now. God damn it. <laughs> Pro Metapod puts everything to sleep, and that's good, except when it's our, when it's on our fucking team. But, all right, nigga, you. I honestly like to be at level 20 before the next gym, before we go and see Misty. It'd be really, really nice if we could be at level 20. Because I think by then we'll start to pick up uh, starters, like Squirtle. Alright, yeah, Star Piece and Nugget. Yeah, so this is that this this route is a dead end. So we'll be able to go back. Uh, actually, since we're already here, I think I might go back down and have Homeboy heal us again. Just because, because why not? Just because, because why not? Fuck this thing. Go to sleep. Fuck this thing. Go to sleep. Like, I'm mad. I'm mad that you even just wanted to fuck with me like that. Pro Metapod is mad. Pro Metapod is mad. I feel like... I feel like there's somebody out there with a YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash Pro Metapod. Poison Powder. Oh, God. What's worth it? Oh, we have Harden. Fuck it. Might as well. 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 But, yeah. I feel like there's somebody out there with a channel named Pro Metapod. Like... It just sounds official. Sounds official. And if there isn't one, by the time they see this video, I'm sure there's gonna be one of you pranksters out there that's gonna make an account called Pro Metapod. And just leave comments on the videos and shit. Or a Twitter account and tweet that at me too. Like, hey, hi Nappy, I'm Pro Metapod. 
All right, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Electric type Pokemon to a tunnel? Ew. How about you go to sleep? <laughs> How about you go to sleep? Like, I need to switch train Fat Bat next. That's what I need to do. I need to stop with this. Get Fat Bat and Bird Jesus leveled up too. But you know what? I kind of sort of want to keep the party. Well, I guess they're gonna... Storyline shit's gonna come up, and we're gonna have to box some Pokemon eventually, but still. Still, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Voltorb? Let's go out to Fat Bat. Because Fat Bat's even lower level than Bird Jesus is. So, oh well. Oh the fuck well. I'm sorry. I apologize. And an update for you guys as well on the X and Y co-op, because a lot of people keep asking, like, is the X and Y co-op coming back? Is it done? Is it over with? No, it's not done over with. I'm pretty sure I said this before, but uh, I think what we decided to do is it's going to get moved to Thursdays. So every Sunday will still be Ash Gray, and then, uh, wait, what the fuck? What's the right way? So Ash Gray will still be every Sunday. But every Thursday will now have the X and Y co-op with me and Kristen. Kristen did finish moving. She's all moved in at her new place. Um, but now she's having like some computer issue or something like that. Wait, wait, wait. What the hell? Is this the right way? She's having like some computer issues like with her graphics card or something like that. And she has like this other, her, like her boyfriend's computer. And yes, imagine that you guys. Everyone always tries to ship me and Kristen together, but we're not like together. <laughs> we're not together at all. She, she moved to... To move in with her boyfriend and ooh, psych up the fuck and she had like some issue with her computer and it's like the graphics card or some something's wrong with it she was explaining to me earlier but you know when it comes to computers ain't nobody care ain't nobody care so um she was having some issues with that but i think she said she's getting a new graphics card or something like that and maybe on the computer she's on the time being she can still record but really that's all we're waiting for is to just get her her stuff set up and get her in the position where she's ready to go and ready to record and it'll be back up and running it kind of sucks because it's like we were doing like the giveaways of the Pokemon on that and it's like I feel like no one's gonna be interested in that anymore like we kind of I don't want to say like we killed the series but it's just lost some life in it because of all of this but I mean that's real life that's what happens you can't help real life you can't avoid real life and she she needed to move so she did her move thing she did a move thing to a boo thing ah true all right rare candy who can use it bird jesus you could use it you're not gonna get it you're not gonna get it bird jesus or fat bat can get it i feel like i'm gonna give it to fat bat just because just because not because he's like a better pokemon or anything but just just because we're like we're training fuck it I, i'm not i'm not i'm not being choosy being picky like that I hope this is the right way, or the wrong way, I should say. Yeah, it is. It is! To the dead end with the item. The dead end with the item. So that means we go the other way, to the big, prominent... Oh, can we leech light this thing? Wow, 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 How did I know that was gonna happen? <laughs> How did I know that was gonna happen? I thought the leech light would've done more, but no, it didn't. God damn it. You couldn't have tackled me then? You asshole. You asshole. I play so reckless when it's not even in a Nuzlocke. Like my playstyle is so different. Like if you guys, if you guys caught Blaze Black, like I was, I was trying to overpredict all that shit. But now here in this, I'm just like, fuck it, switch train to hell and back, go for a Leech Life on a Geo Dude, and catch a Rock Throw like that, or Rock was it Rock Throw? Not Rock Slide. Cause ain't nobody care, ain't nobody care. And your jolly fucking ass just spotted me from nine miles across the fucking room. I don't know. Again, the OCD in me wants me to like go back to Homeboy and heal the Pokemon. Just because I feel like like everyone knows from the anime who's fucking with Clefairy and Mount Moon. So I want to make sure that I'm all healed up and ready to go. All healed up and ready to go. So there was three routes we could take through this shit, and uh, we explored two of them already. So fuck it, let's go ahead and get through the last one. Look at Fat Bat. Fat Bat's so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Fat Man is so stupid. He got one shot it. Oh my god, they scared the hell out of me. Oh my god, they scared the hell out of me. Oh my lord, they scared the hell out of me. Like, I blinked at the same time the screen went dark. Like, I didn't realize that it went dark until after it happened, but I blinked at the same time the screen went dark. So I just, like, I blinked and then Team Rock was in front of me. Prepare for trouble, Twerp. We want the Moonstone to power up our Pokemon. Ready or not? Really? Really? Moonstone to power up your Pokemon? So, do you, are you legit mean power up or just evolve? <laughs> C 
cohorts, Team Rocket cohorts. You couldn't put Team Rocket, Jesse, and James. Oh god, they're Pokemon. The levels. The levels. They're not playing around. They're not playing around. Thundershock, you bitch. And the paralysis! And the paralysis! And it can't move! I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Hold this for me. Hold that for me. Goodbye. Goodbye. You are no threat. You are no problem to me at all. No threat, no problem, no threat, no problem. Coughing? Yes. Let's go back out to Fat Bat. Get all the experience. Get all the experience. I don't know if they have the experience share in Ash Rare or not. It'd be nice if they did. I can tell you that much. It would be really, really nice if they did. I'm poisoned! You ass! You ass! It would be nice if they did have the experience share because that would make all this easier. Because especially... <sighs> now that I think about it. Oh my god. Now that I think about it. I don't want to spoil anything for the series. But I was going to say we're pretty much just low level the entire time. And Pikachu's like level 900 because he's the only Pokemon that Ash kept the entire time. God damn it, Bobby. It's time Team Rocket blasted off! You may have won this round, but we'll be back! Nigga, ain't nobody care. Please tell me we have an antidote. We have the antidote for Nigga Chew. I know we have the potion. So I'll use it this time. I'll use it this time. I try to save it. That's why I want to go back and heal and all that shit. But it is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Really? We're outside! We are outside, and there are still Pokemon attacking. As if that makes a difference, because, like, you're not outside on routes and shit, but... Oh well. Oh well, 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 oh well. Let's just go. Let's just go. Let's just go and be done. Go and be done with Mount Moon. Really? What What the hell are you doing sitting down here in the corner? I feel like she's gonna be another one of those people that are just gonna, like... Oh, wow, she isn't. Wow, she isn't. I was gonna say, another one of those people that just spot me from nine miles away. What the hell are you doing over here, girl? Wow! Oh, 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 I said it. <laughs> I said it and it happened. God damn. Oh, she's got a Clefairy. Aww. Aww, she got a Clefairy. And you get paralyzed. What the fuck you get for slapping the hell out of me, bitch? What the fuck you get for slapping the hell out of me, bitch? Hell's wrong with you slapping people. Super Sonic. We're about to confuse everybody. Sleep powder them and then Super Sonic them. And then Light Ball Thundershock for the win. Alright, this is the top of Mount Moon. Oh, that's why it's outside. Okay. Like, when you play through Red and Blue, I always picture Mount Moon as, like, just... It's all one floor. You just, it's a very shallow mountain or low mountain. Let's see here. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if Fatback can finally hold his own. Hurt yourself with confusion, bitch. Wait, wait, wait. We have Astonish? Is that what that said? Astonish. There we go. I was going to say Leech Life. Oh, you stepped out of confusion, you ass! Really, dude? Really? 1 HP? 1 HP? 1 HP? 1 HP? Just die. 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 Metapod? No, we're good. We're good. This time I think I'm gonna go out to Bird Jesus. Let's check out Bird Jesus' moveset. Please tell me we have a peck. We do not have peck. F oh, we have Gus. Never mind. That works too. That works too. That works too. That works too. I was gonna say, we just have normal type moves. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? Bird Jesus is putting in work in his very first battle! Oh my lord! Oh my lord, level 10. Oh my lord, level 10. Caterpie? No. Let's do this. Let's do this. Bird Jesus, you got this, man. Oh my god, Bird Jesus! Bird Jesus, the power is real! The power is real! Oh god. Oh my lord. Alright, are we- are we- oh my god, we're still not out of Mount Moon yet! Look at the Clefairy! Look at the Clefairy! Oh my lord. The Clefairy. Don't worry, Clefairy. I'll save you. I'll save you. And this motherfucker is the same as in Red and Blue. Just chilling here in this little pit. Just being annoying. Just being his regular annoying self. Diglett. Nigga, what? Diglett. Nigga, what? Sand attack. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. I did that on, um... Well, I didn't do that. I had it done against me on this past week's top... Five on my channel, it was top five ground type Pokemon. And spoiler alert, spoiler alert, I'm gonna talk about it right now. So click away if you don't want to be spoiled if you haven't seen it yet. Um, but number one was Excadrill, and just to fuck with Callum, I went and uh specifically got a horde of Scraggy and I was gonna earthquake them all. And just me being the greedy cocky fuck that I am, I went for a swords dance when I didn't really need, even need to. The Scraggy level five, like what the hell. And they started spamming sand attack on me. And sand attack, of course, lowers your accuracy. I think, um... I think sand attack and... 
what is it, Mud Slap or Ban in competitive or some shit like that? Because after like the second Sand Attack, you're gonna start missing. And then after the third one and fourth one, you're guaranteed. And I think we got hit like two or three times. Because, you know, they all move all at once. And I what I ended up doing was I had to edit them together. I had to clip them together because I missed an earthquake. How much sense does that make, right? They're standing on the ground, earthquakes 100% accuracy, but because they went for the sand attack, like I killed three of the five scraggies, and I edited it together, and everyone's like, how did, um, how did two of the scraggies die without, or some shit, like how did the earthquake miss, or something like that, that's how it missed. So I ended up, I had to edit it together, and it ended up taking me like a good five minutes to kill them all, because I just kept missing earthquake after earthquake, but we're here now. Do you want to take the moonstone? Absolutely. Absolutely. I am the moonstone. <laughs> I am the moonstone. God damn it! Fuck you, Paris. Fuck you, Paris. Probably need to smash it. Nope. Really, you're back? All right, Twerp. We're here for that moonstone. Hand it over. Oh god. Oh god. The Clefairy are using metronome. It caused a huge explosion. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again. Oh, here he comes, Seymour. No, you found the Moonstone! The Clefairy was prey to it! Thank you for saving the Clefairy from Team Rocket! I decided to live here with the Clefairy- Oh god, he's weird. It's been my life dream to find the Moonstone! Well, nigga, it was just chilling right there. I literally just picked it up, then I became the Moonstone, so you're staring at two Moonstones. And someday I'll travel to the stars of the Clefairy! Okay, you're creepy. You are legit creepy. Alright, get me out of this bitch. Get me out of this bitch, please. Cause you are just creeping me out. You wanna live with Clefairies and shit? And we finally made it down to Mount Moon! Oh my god! <sighs> Mount Moon with the Clefairies. If I caught a Clefairy, or maybe if I get a Clefable in X and Y at a Wi Fi battle, I'm gonna name it Buzz Lightyear. Cause it went to the moon, like to infinity and beyond. I don't know. I just call it Buzz. Let's see if anyone gets the reference. The hell is there just a PC? Alright then. PC is just chilling there. What Pokemon? See, like, I'm afraid to, like, even just pick up Pokemon in the wild like this. Because it's like, we need space in our- Oh, it's fucking normal type, God damn it! Like, we need space in our party for, like, event Pokemon and shit. So, oh well. Oh well, 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 oh well. So we made it to Cerulean City. Look at this. What is going on here? Burglars? Excuse me! You look very suspicious to me! Huh? Oh, I'm not the officer Jenny you met in Viridian. That was my sister-in-law. If you met my sister-in-law, that means you probably had some dealings with the police in Viridian. Now maybe you just stopped to ask her for directions, or maybe you found a wallet in the street and turned it into her. Or maybe you're a burglar who broke out of jail. Huh? Oh, is that your trainer card? Well, that's evidence enough for me. I'm sorry I was suspicious, but I really must find these burglars. The strange thing about it is that they didn't just take any money, just a massive vacuum and a giant hose. But I really don't have time to play guessing games with you, young man, so it's time for you to go. For move along. Shit, I read that before it even happened. God damn it. So they took a massive vacuum and... No, it was a vacuum and a massive hose. Right, I wonder what the fuck they could be doing. I wonder what the fuck they could be doing. But with that, you guys, I think we're gonna go ahead over here and stock up on some items. We did kick a lot of ass in that fucking area. Can we get six? What is it six that does it? Yeah. And some potions. Can we get six? Boom. And some antidotes. Four of them bitches. Paralyzed heals. Can we get four of them bitches? Damn, that's a lot. Let's get. Shit. Let's get one paralyzed heal. And. Two awakenings. God damn it, we picked up. Oh, god damn, the repels too. But, anyways, you guys, I think it's gonna go ahead and wrap up today's episode. I would go on a little bit farther, but I feel like this is a good place for us to stop, a good place for us to wrap it up. And in the next episode, we will find out what the hell is going on with. I was about to spoil it. What the hell's going on here with these burglars who stole the vacuum and the massive hose? But, of course, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Should we? go and just try and complete as many events as we can or should we just play through it and just hit whatever we hit along the way because if we we're going to do the events then we're going to have to have certain pokemon in the party and that might restrict us a bit um and i guess in the next episode because I, really, I don't really want to spoil anything well i guess you know fuck it fuck it fuck it the, the thought process that i have is if we go by the pokemon that we're supposed to have in the party and everything like that then that's going to hinder us because the events are going to have us like swap pokemon out like I feel like 
I feel like I'm spoiling it for some of you guys that haven't seen it, but if, if you have seen the anime, which I'm assuming a lot of you guys have, then you know there's, there's the episode where Ash parts ways with Butterfree. So it's like, is it even worth training Butterfree right now? Or should, since we already have the Butterfree, should we just put it in the PC? When we get to that part, just pull it out and just do the event. Because what I'm thinking is, like, we're gonna have all these Pokemon that are given to us, and we're gonna, like, work with what we have at the time, but none of the Pokemon are gonna, like, amount to anything. Because we're gonna have it for, like, two episodes, and then give it away. And then come get some other little scrubby low-level Pokemon, and have it for two episodes and give it away. You know what I mean? So, I don't know. I don't think there's... I don't remember if you fight all eight gyms in this episode. I think you might in this episode, in this ROM hack. I know we have badges on the layout. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. But I'm going to stop rambling now, you guys. Like I said, thank you all for the support. I apologize for not, blah, 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 for not having an episode last week. But we should be back on track now. And uh, all that good, lovey w happy bullshit. So, yeah. If you guys want an even longer episode, I guess that's how we can do it for the most part. Um, I think probably like 45 minutes would be the max that I want to go. But if you guys want to keep the long episodes uh, coming, make sure you smash sell that like button. If we can smash like a good 800, 900, 1,000 likes, that'd be amazing. I feel like setting like a specific goal is just like, I don't know. I feel like, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like that... I don't know, my thoughts are all over the place, and I'm just rambling now. So anyways, make sure you smash that like button if you enjoyed today's episode, and you want a longer episode next week. But with that being said, you guys, thank you for all your support, and thank you for checking out the video. You know me, it's to that 182. I'm out!